Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to rush B efficiently on Mirage and rush, having a rush B specific tactic can be really really useful because it allows you to, you to do actually a good tactic and actually switch up the tempo, maybe you play it a bit slow or just want something new to happen or don't have the best weapon then you can always just call it B rush and you'll have a good chance of winning the round and can many many times just surprise your enemies, especially if you do it actually could be rush, and that's what I'm gonna show you today. So, the rush works up out of spawns, so everybody needs to know everything. It can work without spawn, but you won't get out as fast and surprise your enemies as much. So, what's gonna look like is you generally need spawns towards the right side, at least three spawns towards the right side, because you can have three guys fast out. So. The first one, who has the best spawn, is just gonna run as fast as he can through here. Then he's gonna take his smoke and drop it right here at the corner. And then he's just gonna run full speed towards here. When he gets around here, he just throws a flash into this wall right here. It's gonna bounce out this window and blind anybody around this area. Then he's gonna go up like this, throw a flash into right here. This flash is gonna land right here and blind anybody trying to maybe hold this cross. Then he's gonna go out with the flash, like this, clear here. If you see this guy bent, you can't get the free kill on, no need to kill him. The only important thing he needs to do is to go here and clear backside and then swing around like this until he gets some contact and clear side. The second guy is gonna just follow him up here. And then follow through here. He's gonna drop his two flashes right here, so a uh, later guy can pick them up. Then he's just gonna go full on out here, and he's gonna molly car when he runs, and just follow him out the window and try to enter with him. The third guy, he's gonna also come here and go through here. He's gonna drop his flashes too right here. And then he's gonna run out here, and his most important part is that he, if they mollies, he's gonna smoke the molly. And then he's gonna go out here and try to make some presence or just fight with his teammates. Yeah, the, the only important thing is that he doesn't really die, he doesn't need to just go out rushing like this. He needs to, with his teammates right here, try to pick out and sandwich these guys who's playing side. Because many people either throw the smoke right here or try to fall towards uh, the side right here and then you can fight them together with the guys who's pretty fast. But also important uh, that he doesn't stay here for too long. They take the fight, get the kill, then he gets down on side and help. Then you have the last two guys, who's probably the most important ones. It's the guys who throw utility. The first one of them is just gonna go into right here. And go into this corner right here. So this is the fourth guy. He's gonna go right here. Then he's just gonna aim between this right here up to the height of the building. So around here. Then he's just gonna jump from the smoke. The smoke is gonna bounce on top of the building right here. And it's gonna land right inside of here. Then after that, he's gonna run like this. Then he's gonna take the smoke that comes down here and go in like this and jump through a smoke on the corner right here. This is gonna smoke off the window. And it's really important that the first guy who of these two, there's gonna be two guys right here, the first one of them who gets through here needs to throw the smoke because it needs to get down as fast as possible. Then the fourth guy is just gonna go out here. When he runs here, he can throw a flash over here on the right side and then go out and try to help his team. The fifth guy is gonna go like this and go on the left side right here, aim at the top of this building and then jump through. The smoke is gonna bounce, bounce on this building right here, like this, and land right here. Then he's gonna go through here, pick off all of these flashes right here and just throw them over to the right right here. Important that he runs and try to throw them as long as possible and just spam these flashes. These flashes are really good, they're gonna land over right here and it's gotta get anybody trying to play bench, backside. So if you pull all of that together and make it into a rush, it's gonna look something like this. 
<coughs> so you're gonna spawn right here, then run over, then the rush is gonna start, then you're gonna go into side, and because the smokes are so fast, they're actually already gonna pop when you get to around here. Then you're gonna see the smokes, oh, you're gonna see someone, go back like this, get hit by all of the flashes, and just gonna get spam flashes, and even before you know it, they're already gonna be backside and wrapping around you, and your teammates is probably gonna go short right here, and it's gonna get locked behind these smokes. So it's a really good rush and can surprise your enemies so much.